Howdy y'all, Laird here with something a little bit different. Um, I'm playing Huntress. As y'all know, I don't play a ton of Huntress. Also, if you look at the top left side of the screen, you see my Elgato action bar. That means I am playing Huntress with my feet. I am charging and releasing hatchets and doing my M1s and running entirely with my feet. I cannot use my mouse. I have it bound to keyboard buttons, specifically so I cannot cheat and use my mouse. I still have to aim with my mouse. I still have A, S, and D on my mouse, but like, for the most part, W will be with my mouse. Um, with my feet, sorry. Some things still have to be on the keyboard and mouse. If you want me to put the entirety of Dead by Daylight on foot pedals, you'll need to get me like five more sets of foot pedals. <laughs> and if you're so inclined to get me five more sets of Elgato foot pedals, I ain't complaining. I will find a way to set them up with a couple of dozen US like a couple of USB hubs and some patience. Gotta be looking like a pipe organist over here trying to play DVD. To make it doable, you'd have to have like control shift, like instead of control shipping different keys, you'd have to have like shift W, control W. A, S, and D. Like, it would have to be all possible combinations of inputs getting designated buttons, pretty much. Just so it could be done with one foot tap at a time. I don't think I have enough space under my desk for all of them, but if y'all got them, I would try to figure it out. You'd have to build, like, a little staircase out of, like, 2 by 4s and make mounting brackets. I'd probably have to set up a multifunction display at eye level, reminding me what they do. <laughs> it was connected to the Elgato software, so as I changed what they do, uh, it is thrown. I currently don't have another one on there, but I will add it in the very near future. Uh, this will be the YouTube reminder. The 24-hour stream is coming up in the very near future. August 1st. I'll put out a more proper video talking about it soon. Outside of memes like this, I have found great use for this as a content creator. I have it bound, like, so when I'm usually streaming, what happens is the left button, or no, sorry, the far right is mute, middle is clip my Twitch stream, left is when I'm finished setting it all up, it's going to be sending up my going live tweet, and then it's going to switch the button to a new function, like switch it to a new profile, where two buttons are the same, the mute and clip, and the last one will be something else. That is a setup I am starting to fiddle with and work on. And if y'all were curious, uh, whiff, there it is, is the reason we are running this build today. Or this setup. If y'all catch her in Hex chat or my chat, be sure to say thank you. Oh, of course, Whiff. Nothing but the best for you. <coughs> oh, gross. I'm not a fan of Garden of Joy. Huh? Wrong input combo. Um... That was a little high.
Lucky, I'm not gonna get her there. Not with my ability to play. Thank you. No, I didn't think I'd had the range on that. Okay, I should be able to see this survivor's aura if they're on this gen. Yep. Okay. Oh dang, that was so close. I have a theory that's because people just know killers dislike the perk. And some people just play that antagonistically, like... Like, I apologize for the camping on uh, video, guys. I know this isn't super fun, but I have a slug right next to a hook. Oh, uh, I don't even think that there might have been a dead heart there. If there was, I didn't notice it. Man, the extra two seconds from lethal makes barbecue so much 
Okay, somebody's feeling lucky today. Okay, and that's the game. I mean, for like... For literally stomping on these survivors, not a bad game. If anyone who didn't catch the beginning, that probably sounds really confusing. Well, thank you all for watching. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one.